Peter Barnes with the uh, same-sex marriage impact to business. Peter. Uh, and Neil, and the impact on uh, workplace benefits and on government benefits for same-sex couples was a key part of the majority's opinion. Uh, Justice uh, Kennedy, writing for the majority, said, quote, These aspects of marital status include taxation, inheritance and property rights, rules of interstate succession, hospital access, medical decision-making authority, adoption rights, the rights and benefits of survivors, workers' compensation benefits, and health insurance. Valid marriage under state law is also a significant status for over a thousand provisions of federal law. I talked to the lead uh, plaintiff in this case, James uh, Obergefell, about this, uh, about this part of the decision. Here's what he said. I'm thrilled that couples across the country can now benefit from all of those benefits that you mentioned by getting married, by having the right to marry. So it's humbling for me to be able to help make that happen. But in their dissent, some of the other justices who opposed this decision said actually that expanding a workplace and government benefits for same-sex couples was not a legitimate legal reason to, uh, to, to do this. Uh, they said, listen, this is a, a power that's delegated to the states. It's, it's a constitutional issue. Here is Chief Justice's dissent, and he writes here, if you are among the many Americans who favor expanding same-sex marriages, by all means celebrate today's decision decision, celebrate uh, the availability of new benefits, but do not celebrate the Constitution. It had nothing to do with it. Neil. Two days in a row. It's been pretty uh, feisty. Uh, Peter Barnes, thank you very, very much.